guys, my name's Francis with IDA TV. Today we are here at the Anaheim Fit Expo with Roland Kickinger. So Roland, tell us a little bit about what you're doing here and what you do. Hi Francis, well I have here a business as well. As you can see we, uh, we have a chain of nutrition centers that are specifically customized for investors who want to, for example, invest some money and we make them turnkey for them. You know, this health center is a little bit different because we have a diagnostic system, everything is in place and it's a very great opportunity for somebody who wants to get into health and fitness and is maybe not so much familiar with the industry because yeah. I've been in the industry for over 30 years so I would, I would basically guide people and support them throughout their whole uh, uh, business venture. So how did you get into this industry in the first place? Because I know you were in entertainment and fitness and you've done yes. a lot of things. I, I still work in entertainment too. With this kind of business, I lost a bet. That's how I got into it. Six years ago, I worked on a TV show and I said, if, if we wouldn't get signed up for another season, I'm going to open a nutrition store. And it started with one and now we have a whole chain of stores, you know. So sometimes you do things, you don't even know where it's going to go but you get into it a little bit more, you start liking it, and you have, uh, you're doing well in it, and all of a sudden, you know, you, have, you start growing without even doing anything. So without. why a nutrition store? Why not a gym or some type of fitness program? Well, I figure nutrition is, is, is that's the most need is out there nutrition. I mean, gyms are so many out there, but, but really comes down that the nutrition is the pillar. You know, before you actually go to a gym, you should actually consult a nutritionist to understand to dial in the nutrition properly, because yeah. then you don't have to do much in the gym, you know. If you understand the, uh, the, the purpose of a healthy nutrition is a very, uh, very important point, you know. Do you have any nutrition and health tips you can give some of our viewers? Not for you, Francis, because you look perfect. Oh I, I have gosh, nothing for you. oh gosh. For all the viewers out there, I have three simple, th simple things to say. Avoid the three white horses. The three white horses. You know what those are. They are sugar, flour, and salt. The best things in life. Yeah, the best things. Imagine this, three white horses, they slowly pull you into your own grave. Oh, that's a horrible that's uh, terrible. imagination. That's terrible. It is terrible, but if you think about it, it has some truth to it. It does. And if you don't remember anything, just remember the three white horses. <laughs> I, I will have nightmares about that tonight, yes. Okay, and if our viewers want to find more information about you or what you're doing, where can they go? Well, they can go to sexynutrition.com. That's basically everything listed, what we're doing. We do also a pre and post-surgery care for patients who undergo surgery. Uh -huh. We do specific programs with cleansing programs prior surgery. And then post-surgery, we, we do specific nutrition promoting the healing and keeping the inflammations down, which is important as well. So we're doing a lot of things as far as nutrition, because we know the power of nutrition. Yeah. The, the, the right nutrition is actually healing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then, what is your favorite meal and physical activity since you're in this industry? Oh, there's too many. I like nature itself. Everything what comes from nature uh -huh. itself, I'm right there. You know, even even physical activity, I like outdoors. Okay. I'm a big fan of outdoor activity. You know, whether it's going on a nice hike or going swimming across the ocean you know, or riding a bike, you know, all these things are... He can probably <laughs> swim across the ocean. Yeah. Yes, would you like to swim with me? I'm, I'm good, thank oh, you. I appreciate good. it. That's very you're nice. Welcome. And then what's your favorite meal since you're into nutrition? Meal? Oh gosh, there's so many. I mean, I like a good balance of, of everything, what's really out there, what nature provides. Mm -hmm. And I'm not so much really into uh, processed meals, processed foods. Whatever's in a can, I kind of avoid, I stay away from it. You know, I think this is a good way to live by, you know, because nature has everything, you know, for you. But sometimes we get a little bit convenient and we follow the taste buds, yeah. which is fine too. I think a good thing is just really be uh, really balanced, you know. Okay. I think that's that's the best way to do. And Not being too, too intense about one thing, just find a middle way, you know. And then do you have any last pieces of advice for our viewers in regards to nutrition and health? Uh, well, physical activity, uh, we know it's a very important thing nowadays because we don't get much activity anymore because of our lifestyles. We know we, we get up in the morning, we drive to work, we work, and then we come back, you know. Yeah. So, so I think somehow physical activity incorporating a new lifestyle is good. That doesn't mean a gym. You can do anything. You go for a walk, you can be outdoors. 
you know, you can buy a little puppy, you know, and you can walk with a puppy if you want. And uh, just, uh, I think, uh, you know, we have to also listen to the body a little bit. We forgot that, you know. Uh, the body talks to us and sometimes we, we forget to listen, you know. So yeah. it's a good idea to sometimes listen to it and then we have the right answer what we should and what we shouldn't. Well, thank you very much for your time today, Roland. My, my pleasure. It's